January 6th is the Feast of the Epiphany. It's when Christians celebrate the three wise men visiting baby Jesus 12 days after Christmas. But, but for Hispanic families, it's Three Kings Day or Dia de los Reyes Magos. The holiday features parades and other festivities honoring the three kings. It's one of the last parties to wrap up the Christmas season. Teatro Sea, the Latino theater for young audiences in Manhattan, marks the day with processions of giant puppets, live performances. Children just love it. And they are thrilled by all of the entertainment that's happened on the Lower East Side for the past 21 years on January 6th. This year, COVID-19, though, has really put a wrench in some of the fun. You'll hear about that right now because we're joined by Manuel Moran, Teatro Seas founder and artistic director. Welcome, thank you for being here with us. I know you're so excited. First of all, just tell us for those who don't know about Teatro Sea, Manuel. Well, Teatro Sea is the only Latino children's theater in, in New York, and perhaps it's the only space dedicated to Latino children's theater in the United States. We've been in existence for over 30 years, and we present bilingual shows on um, English and Spanish, uh, everything for, for kids, for young adults, uh, and even for the whole family. Talk about the tradition of Three Kings Day. But for 20 years, we've been uh, celebrating, I would say that this is probably the most important holiday tradition for children in Latin America. Very important tradition, especially in, in the Caribbean, in Puerto Rico, in Mexico, and also in Spain. Very important tradition, uh, where the three kings, Melchor, Gaspar, and Baltasar, they arrive uh, in the evening and they bring gifts, not only to baby Jesus, but to all kids. In some countries, even in Puerto Rico, where I'm from, I grew up there, and the biggest gift, it wasn't on the 25th, it was actually on January 6th. There's similarities, though, like the cookies for Santa Claus, there's something left for the animals as well? Correct. In Puerto Rico specifically, the kids, you know, they get like a, a, an empty shoe box mm -hmm. and they put grass and they put it underneath the bed uh, and then that's that's grass for the camels. So in the morning, it's kind of like the cookies and the milk for Santa. <laughs> right. because it, this is for the camels of the three kings. In other countries, they put shoes. There, is, there are many different traditions. It's actually a fun tradition for the kids. Oh, that's so great. Uh, your show that you had planned to have with live audiences, Sueno de Reyes, uh, Dream of Kings. We have a clip from the show. Let's let's first of all just watch. <laughs> that king there on the far left. <laughs> Is that you? <laughs> uh, that's Gaspar. Gaspar. <laughs> yes, it's me. It's my, uh, I'm one of the actors that, that play. Uh, and for 20 years, I've been playing a king, uh, a, a, you know, during the celebration. Yes. This year was going to be different mm -hmm. uh, because we put together a production, a theater production, that not only the kids were going to meet the kings and receive their, their toy and their book that we always do at Big Toy Drive every year, but this year they were just going to hear the story of the three kings um, and with combined with puppets and live music it was going to be a beautiful show we actually did it a uh, few weeks uh, ago yes and we were bringing it back on january 6 and then it will continue until the middle of january but unfortunately a few days ago we had to decide to cancel the on-site productions and to do it virtually and to offer it uh, completely free for the families to, to see this production because of what's happening, the, sure. the COVID case, and we're trying to, to, to be safe. Uh, so everybody will have the opportunity to see this show mm -hmm. starting January 6th at 4 o'clock. Uh, and it's going to be on our YouTube channel, Teatro Sea, mm -hmm. and it's going to be free for everyone to enjoy and to learn about the Three Kings. It's also going to be in English? And Spanish yes, is the way you're doing the it? The show is bilingual. The, the, all the dialogues are in, in English and the songs are in Spanish. We're celebrating 
Three Kings Day, el Día de los Reyes Magos. When la espada Melchor and Baltasar, the three wise men, los tres reyes magos, arrived to Bethlehem to adore baby Jesus. And they brought three gifts, oro, gold, incense, incienso, and myrrh, mirra. As, as much of a bummer as that is, that people cannot come and interact and see the bright colors and celebrate uh, the Feast of the Epiphany, there are opportunities, I'm sure you're encouraging families to make the best of this, uh, that they can't see it in person and that it is a virtual celebration. That's, that's right. We are trying our best. Uh, it was actually uh, three weeks ago, it was actually the first time we reopened the theater after we closed almost two years ago with this production, and now we're back. Uh, to virtuality, but anyway, we are actually, we're, we're very happy to be able to continue the tradition mm -hmm. and to celebrate. Hopefully next year we'll do yeah. a huge celebration again with our giant puppets, but we want to let you know that uh, we are going to display the giant puppets in front of our, our building, in front of our, our theater, which is the Clemente, at the Clemente Soto Vélez. What's the uh, address? Cultural Center. That's 107 Suffolk Street mm -hmm. on, on the Lower East Side, mm -hmm. and we're going to be displaying the puppets so people can, if they go by, they can at least take pictures of it and, and, and try to keep the tradition alive despite what we're going through. We say Feliz Navidad around Christmas time. What do we say January 6th? We say the same, Feliz Dia de Reyes. Ah, okay. Feliz Dia de Reyes. Dia de Reyes. <laughs> My, yes. Manuel Moran, thank you so much. We so appreciate it. I know it's still going to be a wonderful performance virtually. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. For more about Teatro Sea and how to watch the Three Kings Virtual Festival, go to our website, cbsnewyork.com.